Welcome back everybody. Today we're going to do a little science experiment with pool chemicals. If your alkaline level goes up in your pool, you have to get this. If I pronounce this correctly, <laughs> muriatic acid, which is pretty much hydrochloric acid and something else. <clears throat> you put that in your pool and it brings your alkaline level down. But it's also, like I said, hydrochloric acid. This here is a regular egg, raw uncooked here's a little glass container so for our science experiment we're going to make what they call a spongy egg by the way this stuff is nothing to play with normally what essentially is going to happen is i'm going to stick this egg in that acid there and it's going to eat all the shell off of it the only thing that's left is going to be the membrane underneath the shell in the yolk and everything will be intact it will not bust the yolk, but it will it will dissolve the shell. So let's get started. If you get this stuff on, you wash your hands quickly. Oh, and it's a floater. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. As you can see, there's automatically a reaction, and it's blowing up. Look at that. That's cool looking. Like I was saying, it'll eat the shell off and the membrane and everything underneath should be fine. And it shouldn't take too long. If we have a nice thick white foam on top now. With a bug already. That's awesome. <laughs> You can't tell, but uh, if you look closely, you'll actually see it. It smokes. Hey, watch that dissolve for a second. I fashioned a fly swatter handle to work as like when I'm uh, Easter egg dipping things. Look at that. Look at all that smoke. Because I dunked it. Can you see that? That's some nasty stuff. This stuff will actually eat metal. It'll eat concrete it's some seriously nasty stuff now check that egg out and the foam is growing That's some nasty stuff. I wasn't expecting it to overflow. You know, baking soda uh, neutralizes the effect of the acid. So, if you get it on something, put baking soda on it. Let's see if we can scoop some of this off. <laughs> Not working like I planned. But look. There's the yolk. The shell is already almost completely dissolved. You see that? Let me get the focus. Focus. There we go. Sorry about that, people. It is overflowing. You can now see the yellow hue of the yolk on the 
egg itself. And uh, by the way, you don't want to breathe in any of the um, smoke or anything, fumes coming off this stuff. It is seriously some horrible, horrible stuff. I would say, hey, always safety first, but I'm not even wearing gloves today. I'm being a little stupid, I guess. So the level of the acid is going down because it's turned into foam and overflowed. Let's see what we got so far. Look at that. Get the bubbles off of it. It is no longer has a shell that is the membrane of the egg and the yolk. Oh, that stuff stinks. Check that out. Whew. Yeah, that crap stinks. That is what they call a spongy egg. No more shell, just yolk, trapped inside the membrane. Well, don't forget to subscribe, add a like if you like it. Thanks for stopping by.